But yes, finally, finally, finally. So of course, we're back with another Take my video. So yeah, we got some new news right here, of course. Got the great Sandman 1 and 2 Easy A. He's live in the game right now for JP. Um, I'm going to actually have the Jerry tab open, but this is the Easy A campaign. I did a video for them already for the Easy A campaign. There's some stuff I also talked about in that video. I'm going to upload this video after that one. Again, just uploading has been weird because um, just a lot of things happened last week and um, all about uploading. Everything's like a, literally a week off now. Like everything's a week off. Everything's just crazy. It's just been. Really crazy week though, so yeah, of course it's been crazy and stuff like that. I don't know what to upload next or whatever though, it's just been crazy and like a, not a nightmare, but it's been crazy. So yeah, um, I'm gonna go over the ETA info and stuff like that. There's a lot of things to go for in this ETA though. Um, of course, I uh, just want to go to you to go upload that video as soon as we're done with that. Uh, we have a couple new war, um, new, new um, awakenings and stuff like that. We have GT Goku right here. We have Uber right here. Um, again, I remember Goku and Vegeta in their own separate videos um, when I went over the ETA campaign. For Great Saiyan Man 1 and 2 though. But of course, like I said though, um, they're actually both really good though. I know Uber, they made Uber actually really good. Um, of course, you know, because that, you know, he's like, you know, dead father. Him and Goku are like literally dead father at this point. I thought Goku had more potential when he awakened because again, um, um, just again, like no one like really uses guys ever though. But I was glad they're getting away things. I'll make them at least good, maybe runnable on some teams. I know you don't have like a unit or whatever. Cause sometimes those units do kind of slip in. You'd be like, okay, maybe I'll link the them up a little bit more early, or I'll do something different a little bit with them. my scheduling or like my, my um duck complaint, you know, duck on responsibility up in here. So yeah. Oh, they have a new ECA campaign right here, right here for Great Salmon 1 and 2. They, have, they take 45, of course, rainbow medals, just straight up rainbow medals. Um, they only have one event, though, but again, you can just, I think you can do as many times as you feel like it, because it didn't say you're going to do this once a week. But yeah, um, you have a lot of good, like, just um, ECA, like, discrimination playing units. Like, Magic Video is going to be really good for leader skill wise. Um, yeah, the level link and Henry Jackson is really good in the anyways. Like, he quits a lot for me. I gave him some credit. He quits a lot for me. He does a lot of good, decent, like, 300k, maybe 400k damage. Really good, though. Um, STR Vegeta, again, they don't really give that many STR units, but Ooh is really good now. Um, he's a good remote orb changer of what I've heard. I've not seen his full details yet. I think I've, I've seen what Goku, I haven't seen like really, I haven't seen Goku at all that much. I haven't seen these guys at all either. Uh, but I've not, I've seen Ooh, I've seen Ooh here and there. I haven't seen Goku. I haven't seen these guys as well because they didn't get their awakenings. But yeah, I'm going to go over Great Salmon 1 and 2. Of course, they take, of course, you know, the two different paths and stuff like that. They both have rainbow on metals, but I think you get 2 slash 3 when you get the rainbow question mark. So, um, yeah, remember question mark. We get the regular question mark. But yeah, they're all from the Hero and Balloon Extermination Plans. I did do a video for those guys already, though. It's kind of outdated at this point, but on um, the EZ campaign and stuff like that. But again, there's stuff I talk about and go for in that video that I want to get out first before I get this one out. Because if I get this one out first, the other video won't make sense, and vice versa, though. So, uh, you're not really vice versa, but you guys kind of get what I'm thinking and stuff like that, of course. But, um, yeah. But yeah, though, I'm really good for these guys. I feel like they're getting easy. I feel like they kind of needed it, but at the same time, no one really used them. They're already really good beforehand. I'm giving them easy. just kind of buff them, buff them up. I feel like just a little bit, though. We have Super Nintendo Goku's easy A right here, GT Goku, and of course, GT um, Maju right there. They're getting their easy A. They're the easy A area stages. So it goes from Super Saiyan Vegeta and Super Saiyan 2 Gohan right there. They both got their own easy A stages right there as well, though. So from the, um, the hero of the Lost Formation plan. So yeah, again, all the units are pretty much the same. Again, the only two units that do not have the easy A slash awakening are this Gohan and Piccolo right there. You know, the last final units, I believe. But they're probably gonna more units like they're down the road in this um, here on Brothers Villains Destination Plan. But so far, they're all really good, though. Um, I think I talked about Goku about this video. He's actually pretty solid, though. He actually is unique and different. Um, but he's actually really solid as well. Um, I think Goku's really great. Gohan's really good in certain situations. The first batches were pretty okay. I feel like it's more of a testing ground. Like, Goku's okay. Piccolo's actually really solid. Gohan's okay. This guy's okay. But is actually really good. Majin Vegeta is really solid, though. If you want to run him, like, on events and teams and stuff like that, he probably will be on to be really good. Hashtag his awakening is pretty solid though. I've kind of used him now. It's kind of like flat, but we is actually really disgusting as well. But yeah. Of course, it's hard to get bronze. Of course, these are the other stages are for um, the hero extermination plan and villain if you're new or just whatever. Uh, the path to get tab two bronze, two slash three. Um, I think um, two slash three, um, four of course, the hard for bronze. And we're still really the right, uh, right path to get to um, desk, you know, seven, um, whatever one. I think it's like, like for the first one, you get like two, the second one, you get seven. One of the two, they always kind of change it up though, but you do get a lot of metals. And if you get bronze, if you get the rainbow question mark, you get times five bronze or 14 silver, 
Um, same thing, vice versa. Same thing goes for um, Super, but um, you get gold on the left path, rainbow on the right, and of course, you get the rainbow question mark. You get 10 gold or 10 rainbow. Which usually on my last run, I always get a lot of more rainbow or just, you know, I get vice versa or whatever. It's always like that type of run. But yeah, here in Britain, if you're doing so many at this point, they are really easy and simple to go through. But at the same time, again, you got to yeah, get it. You don't have to use like easy yet or whatever. It's kind of your own fault. But if you do not have them specifically, though, because again, new players day one, so I can have all these units. Um, like maybe like a month or two, maybe you'll probably have all these units, maybe it, depending how you summon and spend your summon doki. Because the current player's global guide has gotten are pretty solid, though. Like maybe like a summon, like you know, discounts and stuff like that. You might get like one of these units, but at the same time, you've been playing for like maybe like a year or two, you should have like all these units by now and stuff like that. It's fairly simple and fairly easy to go over and stuff like that, though. But yeah, like I said, here we're building the termination playing units at this point. If you don't have them like easy aid and stuff like that, you have them, you don't have them easy aid. It's kind of your own fault if you don't uh, have them like ready for the greatest and then one to use aid. But yeah, I took over the unit first. I will go over Great Salmon 1 and 2. I did not realize I had them up already. So you do Super Types, Key 3, everything at 150. If you have like all five typings, um, AGL, Tech, all that stuff, of course. Uh, super Attack Effect, raises the attack defense for one turn, cost of damage, you steal Super Attack, really good. The second one is uh, raise, uh, raise attack defense for one turn, and make a call of damage, um, and buffs your allies' attack. Um, um, attack by 30% for two turns. Not that bad though. But yeah, um, again, links and categories will all see the same for these guys. They don't really change them up or add a new one. If they did, then to have these, like some of these easy aids will probably like be disgusting. You don't get like STR Pro with Legendary Super Saiyan Pro, like, yes, STR, Legendary Super Saiyan Pro, STR, Legendary Super Saiyan Pro, STR, Super Saiyan Pro, like, Super Saiyan Pro, like, Super Saiyan for their passive, though, I think they have the passive. No, I did. Attack defense plus 70%. Um, super attack allies get key for. Attack plus and defense plus 50%. Plus additional attack plus 58%. Like, I want it in them. Um, <laughs> unless additional uh, attack that has a medium taste becoming a super attack when um, we're fighting against extreme class enemies. Extreme class enemies defense by 70%. It doesn't really do anything, but mainly, like, it. If you really go, want to go that far, they're going to be really good at Maju Borg Super Battle Road. They were already good beforehand. And yeah, they just buffed them up a little bit, though. Um, I think for the passive and stuff like that. They were already really good support that unit anyway, though, in defensive, like, unit for heroes and stuff like that. But yeah, again, the links are going to be, like, the best one. But for, like, signature pose and stuff like that, maybe running a couple Great Salmon and Fidel team, you know, Great Salmon 1 and 2, or, you know, Great Salmon and whatever team. Um, they're actually going to be really good, though. Again, they can be really good in certain situations, like, you know, um, sharing limits are actually really good. Um, I haven't seen, like, the full links, you know, once, like, you know, full level 10, though. But they actually, again, they didn't really need to change that much for, like, leader skill-wise. Um, 130 is still kind of bleh, but, uh, again, they're a free to pay unit. A free to some like, friend unit we haven't gotten, like, in three years, so, so yeah, they were, like, the last symbol friend unit. Dell Celebration, please give us a friend unit, please! I feel like it's been three years already, but I'd be four if you don't give us another one. Dang. How many anniversaries have gone by? How many? But yeah, they seem actually really good though, stuff like that. Um, I actually do like them though. They're actually um, really good. Very really simple, very really easy. Updated them really good. I like the, how they're built and stuff like that, of course. On to the next unit. Um, it's super safe to go on the way for this guy. All types, key three, everything up 60%. Solid if you're like, you know, trying to look like a good leader or if you're starting out in the game. Greatly um, raise attack for uh, protect defense for one turn. Supreme damage, really good. Dang, his passive is insane. I mean, before he's already really solid support set, you know, already. Even like links, categories, he was already really good beforehand, like before your awakening. You know, a lot of people did use him before you guys awakening. He's actually really good. He's aged pretty well. Um, attack defense was 100%. All allies key to attack defense for 35%. Medium chance of become medium chance of performing a crit and medium chance of evading enemies attack. Clean super attack from the first turn in the um, which character has performed the third super attack in the battle. So I guess you had to get I guess go full additional. I thought he was honestly super saiyan 2 support mostly. If he had super saiyan 2 support and regular support, he probably would be one of the best support type units in the game. But yeah, give him attack defense for 100%. Again, he's a unit that's been out for years and he's still good. Like uh, before you guys were getting he's pretty solid. After that guy's awakening, he's still one of the best aging units in the game. Like, I'm a Gohan stamp. Like, I'm full on Gohan fanboy. So, this makes them great. I'm They always make these type of Gohans good. Even the other one, his like, counterpart from the Hero and Villain Extermination plan, he's, he's probably like one of those units. Honestly, I'd probably say put him on there. Uh, I, think they, I think they both have the same name, though. But the same update does help out that, though, a lot, though. They don't link, though, but you can still have some good support type units. Again, he's a massive good support type unit. They made him the same. Again, he's going to dodge a lot, though. But unfortunately, you know, you got to get multiple super techs to them in order for him to like you know start dodging and ranking up that kind of like little um damage and stuff like that a little bit though but overall though really good for Gohan again they made him really busted insane they made him good as I expected for Vegeta oh he needed one he was horrible he just uh, but I think he, he came out during the cooler movie though so a lot of people were thinking about that but is it like on the category he's just a you know injured for so like a unit we can actually help us up like that he'll probably be good so he does ADO and, and physical key three everything of 80% nah this looks kind of bad 
On smooth damage, lowers defense, and grit lowers defense. Attack with plus 120, and additional attack defense plus 40%. When performing the super attack, an attack enemy's attack defense minus 40%. Okay, that isn't that bad, though. Again, super battle rope and stuff like that, and he might be pretty useful. Because links are, um, oh, he's the perfect battle. Yeah, for like a villain and stuff like that, again, he's not gonna really link up with some of the. No, uh, he's not. Andrew says so he is gonna help out with his other like Super Saiyan Vegeta as well far in the game at this point, even the transforming one. But this guy again, he came out like, you know, like during medical and stuff like that. But again, he's not like a movie boss, movie hero. But yeah, cause he, yeah, he's not like a movie boss or whatever though. Cause otherwise, yeah. Um But yeah though, um he seems um Pretty solid though, again. He's really solid though. Again, attack defense plus 120. Don't underestimate that. That's it, is really good. EM getting additional attack defense for percent every time he gets the super attack, essentially. It's really good though. You can stack up that damage to make him a really good tank. So yeah, he's actually really solid though. He can, he can make him a really good tank for more super attack and stuff like that you get with him. And four additional. And I mean, if he really, if he raises his defense up a little bit, now I, if he was like a good defensive tank and they really want to go that far, make him raise up his attack and defense. Um, maybe for like one or three turns with his super attacks and stuff like that, or indefinitely. That probably would have made him really good if he made him like attack and defense. Up. That probably is like my only complaint though. Otherwise, um, really good though. Again, you can get some really good potential defense with this guy and attack and as you go on with the um, meta and stuff like that. So for Goku, does all types, yeah, same thing, like same loot skills as Vegeta. Yeah, no, let's go on. Same loot skills let's go on, I believe though. The all types key three, everything goes 60%. Raise attack defense for one turn, screen damage and um, the enemy. Takes place plus 150, key three plus an additional attack defense plus 40 percent for four turns. I had a performing a super attack, which you can, I think, um, kind of. Not stack it, but you can kind of like, you know, every time you get a super attack or whatever, um, you can just keep doing this or whatever though. So yeah, Goku didn't really change that much for him. I mean, they, I feel like Goku really kind of need, needed some of it, but he was already pretty good damage dealing unit anyway. Oh, he if he attacks, really attacking defense. Okay, I don't know why they kind of buffed him down for the passive and stuff like that. Again, like Vegeta, like I said though, he's gonna give himself key and stuff like that, and basically after he does a super attack and stuff like that for four turns, uh, but he'll just basically, again, he has, he has the Vegeta thing where he can come potentially good as a, um, Unit, self sufficient unit for himself and really good attack and defense. Um, so I agree with the same thing for Vegeta. Um, just that it, again, it made him, it gave him the thing I wanted for Vegeta the most, honestly. Yeah, it's gonna really good, be a really good attack defense unit and defensive unit overall, though. On the GT Oob, though. Um, but yeah. Um, also, yeah, same thing, same thing as well. Attack defense rate, greatly raises attack defense for one turn, spin damage, and lowers attack. Um, really good though, of course. Really good. Attack defense plus 120, plus additional attack defense boost, um, plus up 80%. Basically, the more HP you have, the better, the greater boost and stuff like that. It's always really, I like those units. Uh, Pentium gets all types when HP is 80% or more. Randomly changes key spirits up to a certain type of rainbow. I think they kind of changed that a little bit as well. I heard they kind of buffed it slash changed it. But they made Oob, again, really, really good. Like Goku, they made him really good. Again, they don't, they don't need to make these guys the most OP units because they did come out a couple years ago though. But at least make them decently good for nowadays. But Goku seems really solid. Vegeta, again, gave home the thing I really wanted for Goku though. But overall though, Oob, um, I think not this before though. Again, really, really good though, of course. And again, give him effective gets all types really good because he was fighting off everybody in GT. Like, he was fighting off everybody when he fought Baby when they first fused. And on top of that, like him and Oob, like him and um, Ubu first fused. That's all with that. Him making him a rainbow orb changer, really good. I like that though, of course. So yeah, pretty much good. Go ahead and video there. It's my all my full thoughts and opinions for all these guys though. Really simple, really easy. Like I said, Oob's a really good guy. Orb um, changing and stuff like that, really, really good. Um, you get him long attack and stuff like that, really good. Goku's really solid as well. Again, I feel like they should give Vegeta infinitely attack, stacking attack and defense, or at least do it for three turns. Again, they should they just give him the thing I wanted for Vegeta the most. I hate that kind of. But yeah, Vegeta seems really good. Him and Goku are pretty much gonna be really good for like stack, stacking defense. Kind of really in the not Vegeta, but really more Goku with stacking attack and defense low key kind of. Um if you can like four additional go four all on out, which I think that is what I did for him. Um yeah, again, like GT Heroes kind of use it though a little bit though. Him and Uber actually gonna be really good replacements. Go Hot Body is like one of the best units on here. Him and Great Salmon went to Ambit. Um, like all these units all impress me though in their own way though. So yeah, pretty much go go ahead and end the video there though. Of course, new units, newest hero, available termination plan, all that stuff. Yeah, see you guys there though. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Great luck. I'll again though. Make sure to stay safe. Watch your hands. God bless all of you. If you're going out and wear a mask, plus if you really, 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 but you guys think about all this info though, of course, did you like it, did you hate it? I was too excited, I'm sorry, I couldn't hold myself back anymore though, but yeah, really good stuff. See you guys later though, we can help. Peace out.